I'm Lauren Vieira, I'm 28, I'm a senior designer at Q and I study fashion design at White House in Sydney. In 2007, I studied at Accademia Italiana, which is in Florence, Italy, one of the most beautiful cities in Italy. I won a full scholarship on completion of my graduate diploma at White House to study in Italy, which was, it was the best thing in the world. It was so exciting. Their approach to fashion is very literal, it's very aesthetic, so where Australia is quite technical, it was a completely different way to learn about fashion. At Q, I'm a senior designer and you pretty much have to follow through your design from the initial concept and sketch to liaising with the pattern makers to getting the sample made and to putting it through to production all in one week because we work very tightly to schedule so we can have new garments in stores every single week. Q's actually been going strong for more than 40 years, so they're a family owned business and the owner is very passionate. He's always in the design room asking you questions. He's very involved in his business. It's lovely that it's still a family owned business and it's still run the same as it was when it started. And we do like to make everything onshore and locally and support the local workplace and workforce and so there is always jobs in Australia and not just for pattern making and making the garments for, for buttons, trims, accessories and things like that. It's, it's supporting the Australian environment because everything's going offshore and it's kind of disappointing but it's, it's Kiwi's actually the largest manufacturer of women's wear in Australia. So The advantages of manufacturing in Australia is you can actually see the garments come to life and you can work with the pattern makers to develop the best fit and make sure you can have a handle on every step of the creative process, which is really important because that's what you miss out on when you do offshore. I'd say my experience in Italy has definitely helped me culminate my garments for this exhibition. The fabrics that I've used for the garments, they're quite unique. They're actually sourced from Europe and from Italy. So we've got beautiful matte double weave stretch cottons and you've juxtaposed them against beautiful shiny stretch satins and beautiful thick veil ottomans and they're quite luxe and quite expensive. These fabrics are really rich and luxurious. <laughs> One of the big things that I've done in my career is actually go on Project Runway and it was one of the most amazing experiences I've had in my life. It was very creative, threw you in the deep end and I loved every minute of it. I'd been working at Q for six months and then Project Runway came up and I just couldn't say no, I had to do it. <laughs> out of Project Runway, besides having to learn how to make a garment out of onions and washes and completely avant-garde left field materials, you kind of find who you are as a designer and really find your talents and your strengths and it really helped develop my sense of design. The thing about fashion I most enjoy is not actually the finished product but the journey to that product and actually seeing a creation come to life and developing that, that's what I really enjoy.